Warning, some things in this video may not be appropriate or even disturbing for some viewers to watch. As such, viewer discretion is advised. Hello everyone, welcome back to some more Beyond Two Souls. Last time, what did we do last time? We finished off the homeless chapter and I believe started off uh, this one. Yeah, uh, we're not gonna, this might be a less longer episode, we're gonna go to like the end of this level, but yeah, it's been a while again, so I don't remember too much, I think it's just time to go have lunch, yeah, have a seat, thanks, right, we, we um, we, we escaped the police, this is currently now past the prologue, there's a lot of work to do on the ranch, yeah, Jay takes care of the horses. I watch the churros, and my father does just about everything else. Hmm. Are there other Navajo ranches around here? There used to be about 50 some years back, but now there's just us. The others got scared off. The others decided to go live in the city. Scared off by what? Not everyone wants to live in the desert. That thing that came out at night, or? I saw the dead sheep. What happened to them? A storm. They wander out of the pen and choke to death on the sand. Yeah, with their organs coming what out. What were those noises last night? It sounded like something was banging on, on the house. And... That's just the wind. They make yeah. strange sounds in the desert. The wind makes You always ask so many questions. Noises. When I don't understand something, yeah. Yeah? How about if I started asking you questions? Where you come from? What you're doing here? You probably wouldn't like it, huh? So keep your secrets to yourself. And don't ask any more questions. No, excuse me. I got work to do. him Jody he's okay when you get to know him I'll bet well I guess I better get back to it or Paul will get mad <laughs> see you later well done Jody Jay's doing. Whoa. Whoa. Proud and stubborn. And everyone's going with the others. Do you mind if I try? You worked with horses before? No. Go right ahead. My name's Ashki. Slowly Don't be afraid. Approach. I'm just gonna come over there, okay? Okay, slowly approach. <laughs> Can we just? Hmm. No, I didn't. This is between him and me. Oh. Thought we'd be able to body jack the horse or something like that, but no. Um. I guess you're supposed to come to him slowly or something? That's not so bad, is it? Admit it. You kind of like me, huh? <laughs> hey, 
ride in. Ever dreamed of riding a horse? Oh. Now we can take control of the horse? Wait, but... I don't remember them ever showing Iden take being able to uh, body jack horses or whatever. So like... Yeah, I mean, we know we, we, you know, we, know we can mind control pe people, but not like animals. That opens up the possibility of could he, could he, couldn't he have controlled the dogs you that we do fought that? earlier, or we all like? Have our secrets, right? Maybe I misjudged you. If you want to take a shower, it's behind the bar. Ladies first. It's fine by me. Okay. Hmm. I do like how they whole have this whole sense of like foreboding here, like something's being hidden from you. Because it's like no one's talking about it, no one's saying anything. Seriously. Whatever, I might have to cut this scene out. Or if not, put like a, a grace, the dreaded grace square over it again. This has gone on for like way too long with so little payoff and... Oh. Not sure if I can show that, but he was hmm. never seen again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, time to go to our rooms. <laughs> like an alarm clock or something. It's time to go to bed. What's happening here? Why do we have to lock up the house? Just go to your room, Jordy. And don't come out, no matter what happens. You remember the sheep last night? I don't want anything to happen to you. Yeah, I'm not gonna persist. Better not to press the issue if they're like so concerned about hiding it. Let's head to our room and go to sleep as per usual. After all, what the? Okay, I guess we're supposed to go over here for something. I don't know. supposed to do? <laughs>
Also, why are we doing this again? Like, and why does the moon look like an object in the sky? <laughs> Why is the moon literally like an object in the sky instead of an actual moon? Oh! Oh, that's what we're hiding from. That's what was pounding on the house. in your room. You could have been killed. What's happening here? What was the thing? You should have listened to me. You stayed in your room. You have to tell me the truth. You have to tell me the truth now. It's Yeitzo. He wants blood. That's all he's interested in. We can't do anything about it. You can't fight a spirit. Spirits don't live in this world. If he's here, there's a reason. Hmm. And the Yitzos comes from the other world? The place the spirits come from, or...? We're friends, right? I'm just gonna put my foot in the stirrup and climb up, okay? About to fall off. Oh, or maybe not. I need to figure out how to go forward. Hey, what do you think, Ashki? We're doing pretty good, huh? That horse is gonna have to tell me your secret. <laughs> Listen, I'm headed over to the pasture to tend the churros. You wanna come? Sure. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, oh. Finally, we get a run button. Really? So though, I wish we had like integrated, integrated item more into those quick time events, like being able to press a triangle or something. 
That's seriously what I would like about this game, being able to press triangle at any time to help out your partner. Or something like that. Well, not partner, but like to help out Jody or something like that. Play as Aiden, if that makes sense. Or better yet, why not be able to press, tri press triangle at any time during gameplay or something? Or maybe make this a co-op game. It's called Beyond Two Souls for a reason, right? Why not have one player play as Jody and the other, and the other play as Aiden? <laughs> Kind of like, um, what game was it called? When they were coming out of prison and everything? I don't know. Kind of like It Takes Two. Whatever. Look, I, I know you don't want to talk about it. But I really need to know what happened last night. What do you think happened last night? And the ghosts that surround the house. Oh, I was supposed to ask. Do you know whatever. who they are? My father says five spirit guardians have always protected our tribe. They come at night to prevent you so from killing us. By waving around spirit fire at true. it? But Yeetso has never managed to get into our house. I guess it ends here. Your father knew the spirit. It's not the first time he's come, right? Yeetso has always been here. It comes at night and steals souls. The old ones used to say, it's a curse. The price our tribe had to pay for living on these lands. My turn to ask you some questions. All right. What are you really doing out here in the middle of the desert? It feels like you're running away from something. Yeah, truth. Why not? I guess I'm just trying to forget. You know, make a new start. Maybe I'm just running away from myself. You're like us. You also have your dark secret, don't you, Jody? I have to tell you something. Hey. Jay. Jay. We can't be close. Oh, is that? The bad boy shot. I. I eat on. She in the dish. That was Paul. There's no water at the ranch. Something must be up with the well. I'm gonna have a look on my way back. I can go take a look if you want. Uh, don't know if you'll be able to do much. I'll do what I can. Where, where's the well? Uh, it's over there. It's got a windmill. Shouldn't be hard to find. Oh, okay. okay. I'll see you back at the ranch. Okay. See you later. <laughs> you know, the weird thing is, maybe it's just... Because of me, but this really feels like it's supposed to be a huge open area you can like run around. When it's kind of not, it's more linear. It just looks very open. player plays as Jody or something like that. Whatever. Here's the well. What time? How, how long are we in this? 19 minutes? We can wait another like a few seconds. Running. 
Do we have to do something else around here, or...? No. Well, I guess we don't. Well... Okay, well, I guess let's, against our better judgment, let's just go out. <laughs> Find where the weird spirit thing is. What is this? A tomb? Or a, no, a bunker is what this is. Hmm. We just leave. Hmm. Yeah. The village literally lit on fire. <laughs> Was that real? Because we literally saw the horse in the real world. Crown. Did you have to look for the to see that? Really? Huh. That looks like a crown. Those rocks look like a... Whatever. What's over here? Can you see anything I did? Oh. Alright, let's move on. Maybe a little bit faster. There it is. Alright. Oh, so the spirits have been here for the longest time. Most likely. I scared the soldiers in the fort. Could it be Yezo? Then it must have spawned from that huge fire or something. Maybe like, maybe it's like spirit of vengeance, like the 
What's it called? Like the what's it called? The spirit, the spirit from until dawn. From the Wendigo. That's what it's called, or something, something like that. Of like, oh, you burn the village down, so I'm gonna get you back, or something like that. Hmm. Yeah, because these seem to be like the same kind of spirits that what's it called? We fought in the condenser. So does that mean? This one is one of those spirits, but like it's been around so long, it's gotten more and more powerful. I have to find that. Hmm. Is there anything else here? Ooh. Must be wondering, like, what are, what are we doing? Hmm. Right, we gotta find the forked tree now, which is where exactly? I mean, it has to be past here, but. to get rid of the entity. Create the ritual using Jody. Weird. This one has no talisman. Meaning the talisman must be somewhere else. Gave the talisman to a child. I didn't understand it. 
What do you not understand? You literally, it just takes a small bit of deductive reasoning. It's as if something's missing. They were doing the ritual. Something was missing. Ah, uh, the fifth Paul. talisman. And Maybe then, know something. what's it called? Yeah, the fifth talisman was missing. Then, they couldn't do the ritual, so... Ooh, shoot. Like, literally, it's... It isn't that hard to put together. probably get to what we're supposed to actually do. The fifth medallion. It's, like it. it's the one that was on that baby. Mother gave it to me. You can talk? Like her mother before. Oh, she's not she's not she kidding. It was passed down. generation to generation, probably for this moment. for the white man. It brings spirit to kill their enemies and gain revenge. 
turned against them. He was still hungry. Hungry for blood. Yeah, it's all is back. He has come to take our lives. Or your ancestors. They're the guardians who protect the house, right? They know they were wrong, so they returned to protect us from the evil that they released. If they brought the entity here, I mean, there's got to be some way to send it back to its own world. They used a ritual to open the passage. They know to have the real I still remember the incantation, but the ritual is lost in the past. I saw it. I saw the ritual in my vision. I'll prepare it and you can help me with the incantation. Hurry! He's coming. All right, we need a fire and some sticks. Fire. I have to make a fire in the front of the house. Can't ask the boys to come help, does it?
entity has been sealed. sacrifice. It was. It was. But if I did this right, then... No white man has ever been to the place I'm taking you. My people have buried our dead there for many hundreds of years. For us, it's sacred land. Huh. Wait then, how long have entities been around in this world? Because then, if since ancient times, like, or like since the olden times I should say, or something like that, it's been active, aren't there more entities out? Like... You can't tell me the Yitzhak is the only one that, what's it called, has actually like grown in strength, or like has appeared through a portal before can't be things right I think yeah yeah I knew it because we healed Paul he's here with us now instead of just the two brothers I remember my first playthrough we I did not heal Paul at all because I, I didn't even know we could heal we could heal him I just went straight to Shimasani and everything So are they not going to ask questions of like, oh, who was the fifth soul or yeah, whatever.
did they have to pay for the match what's called box to look like that? Because predicted that we'd come here? No. There were people like us that were tethered to spirits in earlier times. Right? Yeah. That, make, that would so make sense. Decided. We're not the only ones. You're leaving? There's things I have to do. No, I... I used to think that my gift was a curse. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe I can use it to help people. Find out who I really am. You did a lot for us, Joy. For us and them, the memory of our people. I don't know how to thank you. If you don't find what you're looking for, come back here. You have a home. I'm gonna miss you. Me too, Cleo. I'll never forget you. Very sad without you. But one day I'll come back and see you. This hug, like, we literally just met this guy in this chapter. Why are we already, you know, like, doesn't make that that, that wouldn't make sense. Hey Jody, you didn't think you were just gonna walk, did you? Time, but I finally got the thing running. Take it, it's yours. It's the least we can do to thank you. Thanks. Spirit. I was wondering, like, what, why is she there? I thought she died. No, it's her spirit. <laughs> Stupid. Whatever, that was Navajo. Probably, like, in my opinion, probably, like, the best chapter in the game. To be honest with you. Like, yeah, to be honest, that's probably, that's probably the best chapter in the game. I don't, like, I don't remember what comes after this chapter because I remember, and I hope it doesn't happen here. But, if I recall, then the next level, um, like the game kind of froze up or something, I don't know. And, whatever. Anyways. 68%, I didn't explore the house. Yeah, that's good. Didn't venture outside. Yeah, most people probably did. I didn't, because I'm smart. <laughs> they say don't open the doors. I'm not opening the door. Opening the doors. Didn't repair the bike. I didn't know there was a bike you could repair. I mean, like, whatever. Um, escape the Itzo. The, oh, it's, it's, no, there's a pause, I think, after the E. So, Itzo, I think, it's pronounced. I mean, that, that's basically quick time events. Told Jay the truth. Why wouldn't you? Healed Paul. I can understand the 26%, because I, I didn't know you could heal Paul until... I was like looking up online how to say I was like looking up online not how to save but how to like you know guides on each of the levels and everything and I found it. <laughs> fifty three percent hugged Jay before leaving and ninety one percent completed the ritual. Well, that's nice. But with that being said, we're gonna end things here. We're already like fifty minutes in anyhow in the next level, although it's not long, it's something. Plus, the next level is... Li I, I literally think it's like the beginning of the, the last, I guess, quote-unquote, 
arc or last act of the game. So, yeah. Anyways, that'll be all for this one. So, I'll see all, all of you in the next video.